So this is part two of our Auschwitz. Um, uh, I don't remember the name of the other one. Yes, the other uh, one it started with a B, and anyway, it's the big one. And I think what hit me the most was just like, because they had the train track going right through, and that train like brought so many people, and they, yeah, like they had no idea. Yeah. And it was just incredible, like walking that same road, like once they would have gotten off the train and been herded into these different areas, like, yeah. no, um, yeah, just like looking down and seeing the road and like, and how many people have walked that. Yeah. What about you, Isaac? No, I said mine. Okay. Um, the the uh, the walls. They were they were like this, right? Like that they're posts and they're kind of curved. And it just reminded me of like a claw, you know, just like holding in. Yeah. But there was so many. It was so big. It was so big. It's so big. It took about what an hour and a half. The, it's about a kilometer hours. square. Took a long time to like walk. So four kilometers we walked around the perimeter of the, it w you know it wasn't even the perimeter actually, we just walked uh, four kilometers around, but there was more to one side. So it's really big. Yeah. Oh. And the there were there were the gas chambers and crematoriums, that were blown up when the Nazis were fleeing. Yeah. But they had like um. Little, was on the little information things. They had like the map of what, like the floor plan of what the um, buildings would have been, <laughs> and it's just terrible to see what each room was and what, uh, what they were doing and stuff. Yeah, it was really hard. No. To be there, but I think good at the same time because I think that we can't forget what had happened, and yeah, we can't repeat it. Then after that, we came to this beautiful place. Can you flip this? Oh. And this is where we were staying for the next however many days. Um, four, five days. Yeah, four, five days. Oh, yeah. It's very cute. And the people here are so beautiful and welcoming. Yeah. They ended up, because we were a little behind schedule, we were supposed to come here first before Auschwitz, but we were behind schedule, so they actually saved supper for us till we got back at 11. Yeah. With, or 10 30. We're all and just tired, but they had a the big, big meal. <laughs> they welcomed us like they were waiting by the door and they did a little song and they were dressed in their Polish attire and like it was really cute. Yeah. Lots of pierogies. Oh, yes. <laughs> like we, we were so tired, but it, they kept bringing out the food. <laughs> yeah, it was good. And our rooms are really awesome. And yeah. yeah. So, yeah, that was yesterday. And, uh, yeah, it's. Crazy day, really. Uh, packed. A lot. Yeah, lot, yeah packed. packed. A lot to think about and pray about, but it was good. Right. And today we're off to no. go see. No. Bye. The place where JP two was. <laughs> <laughs> and his, his hometown. There's a yes. museum there. We're going to the museum, and then yes. today starts. We get the... to go meet up with all the Canadians in Krakow. So. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. okay. Bye.